What's going on guys, it's Shane. We are back here again with another video. Today we're going to be doing something totally different. Today we're going to be playing Fishing Planet. This is a game I have not recorded in a very long time. If you look at my older videos, you'll see a few on there. Um, however, I like to play this in my free time a lot. So I figured, you know, I've been grinding it a little bit. I'm here at San Joaquin uh, trying to get these white sturgeon, level 40. Figured I'd just do a video on it, so why not? Um... This is my in inventory, if uh wondering what I'm using. Still got these bottom snipers. Uh, very basic, but uh, they've been getting the job done. So we are here. And I'm just, I'm just fishing. That's all I'm doing real quick. That's all I'm doing. Anyway, I got uh, two of them out here. Can only put two rods in this holder, so... Uh, my current, oops, let's see, I think I just fast forwarded, yeah, I'm getting a lot of carp, I don't really care for the carp here, uh, I am using, uh, uh, what's that bait that I'm using, muscle meat or whatever it's called, duck muscle meat, yeah, um, when I leave here, I'm gonna be getting the, uh, spawn sack, so I've been here for quite some time, I have not left in a long time, I'm, Two hundred fifty-six thousand dollars. It's amazing. I remember when I used to be broke on this game. <laughs> I still kind of am though. Uh, oh boy, great, great, great. I haven't played in a while though, so I've been getting used to the uh, the whole keep net thing. I know that's kind of new uh but yeah somebody's got a floating sinker here I do have a kayak actually I think yeah this one's mine isn't it yeah but I had a blue one oh I oh we got something on what is it which one ah the one on the right so, a lot of people would recommend to uh, be in a kayak when you're using these bottom snipers. However, uh, pulling them in from the shore has actually been pretty fine for me. Uh, like I said, these carp, I hate the carp. I only keep them because they are, they do uh, give you money. And I have a big keep net, so I don't really care about how much. I've actually never filled up my keep net here because... Um, you know, you fast forward too quick, you know, and you have to. You don't want to sit here all day. Uh, we got ourselves a sturgeon. Let's see. See how easy that was? And this is a 54-pounder. That's almost my PB right there. Oh, wow. Look at that. Nice. Very nice. Let me get a screenshot here. I, free I don't even know how to take a screenshot. I'm used to playing Roblox the screenshot uh he is like uh the whatever you call that key i don't even know what it's called but got a few people here some people in some clubs i'm not in a club i need to join one though look at that see how quick that is i don't have to be in a kayak honestly a lot of people like to recommend to be in one but when you're catching them this close to the shore it really doesn't matter uh now you can see the kind of damage they're doing to my pole, so <laughs> I will need to uh when I, I, I plan on returning back to uh the main menu when I run out of uh bait because I'm gonna repair my poles and I'm gonna uh uh get the spawn sack. So yeah. I really want to get the blue crab. That's I can't say it's my favorite map because I've never been on it, but I think it is like my favorite map visually out of all the videos I've watched on it and stuff. I want to get to that. So look, look at the damage on my uh, pole here, on my line and on my reel. Uh, yeah, they do a little bit of fighting, but once you know how to do like, I've been playing this game for years, so I know how to fight these fish. Granted, I just got to San Joaquin, like, 
I don't even know. I play off and on, you know. I take a big break, so I can't really tell you when I hit level 34 to come here. Even though I didn't come here until like level 36, though. Because that's what they recommend. Uh, come on, come on, get in there. There we go. 41 pounder. Now they would recommend to fast forward the time. But she could theoretically do that a little bit. Kind of helps, I guess. But we've already got almost $10,000. You guys saw how quick that was. We're not even, what, how many? We're like, what, five minutes into the video. That's crazy. That's crazy. And I'm not, I'm not making any cuts or anything. It's going to be authentic. Uh, I do have a float rod as well. Uh, it's a little weaker than my bottom snipers, but I suppose we could use it. I never get anything off of it, though. Yeah, see, we're about to get a hit. Yep. 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 Put down, put down, put down. Oh, another. Let's go, man. Ah, come on. They will pull you out, though, but I do my fair share of, like, reeling in and Pulling up on the pole, so I don't know if that's like an actual technique in this game, but it seems to work a lot. Look at that 48 pounder. So we are over $10,000 in just like six minutes. How crazy is that? That's nuts. And a lot of people would recommend, you know, go ahead and switching to the next night. Uh, I'm going to do that here in just a second if I don't get another hit. I don't like the flashlight. It's too uh, glary. You can see all the glare. I like to keep it off. I think that's something to do with my graphics. I don't know. I don't know. They are all maxed out, though, so. Uh, but this is where it drops off here. Bunch of sturgeon. Okay. I know a lot of people like to fish from that island over there and kind of cast out by the uh, docks over there. That's another good spot I heard. All up on this side is a good spot as well. Um, I don't know what spot's better. Is this one or the one over there? I really don't know. I haven't tried it over there because I have to kind of fish from the shore here since my poles aren't the greatest, like I said, so... Uh, we do kind of fish from the shore here. It's quicker. Obviously. Please tell me we have another sturgeon here. It's a carp, isn't it? I hate the carp so much. I hope when I buy the spawn sack, I hope carp don't eat those. I think they do, though. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I can check here in just a second. Yeah, I hate the carp so much. If I wanted carp, I'd go to one of the European maps. Yeah. Oh, we're getting another hit on that one. We're about to, at least. Mm. If they get too close, they kind of just, like, despawn. That's probably what that one just did. At least I think they do. I got a marker there for absolutely no reason. I don't know. Did I catch anything there? I did, but it wasn't even my PB. Oh, my lord. Which one are you? Which one? you I get a lot more hits on this one for some reason man we almost got my PB in this video we might, huh? crazy I'd like to get on the leaderboard I think the leaderboard for the uh, white sturgeon here is uh, 55 pounds I believe I believe that's as high as they go here I don't not 100% sure on that Yeah, I miss making videos on this game. Granted, I never really talked in those videos, but I, they were kind of like tutorials. And when I did record them, it was all on the PlayStation. So uh, what kind of sucked is I was 
playing on PlayStation. I played this game first on PlayStation. I worked my way all the way to like level 39. Then I got a PC and I'm like, wait a minute, you can't even convert your data. So I had to level all the way back up on PC. So that kind of hurt. However, good news is I'm a level 40 on PC and a level 39 on PlayStation. So I've officially passed my old level. It's that one, isn't it? I'm going to be very surprised if it's that one. We just threw that out there. Probably that one. Yeah. Yeah, see, he's... You can almost see him down there. There he goes. Look at that. That. Ah, they don't let you pull out the keep net early. Oh, it's a car. Oh, my God. What a waste of energy. Like I said, I just take them just because I need the money. Here in no time, we're going to be up at, to like 300,000. Yeah, I think, man, we're almost at 300,000 pounds in my keep net. That's crazy. 15, almost 15,000 in one night. That's nuts. It figures I start recording and I had the best night of my life on this game. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Are we getting another hit? Well, I know what the title of this video is going to be. $15,000 worth of sturgeon in less than 10 minutes. It's this one, isn't it? Yep. Come on, please be a sturgeon. Come on. Yes. 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 How big are you going to be? Keeping that is a little buggy, but 44 pounds. Dude, 16,000. It's nuts. Oh, my God. $16,000 worth. It's nuts. I'm sure people who have like three poles, four poles get a lot more, but with two poles, that's pretty impressive for me. And we're in the low peak now. Nice. Another carp. My goodness. Man, we are getting hits left and right. Oh, it's a trophy. Doesn't feel like a trophy. Is he still going down? Might have took the bait. Nope, 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 nope. Come on. Yes, sir. You're a carp, aren't you? God darn it. You're a trophy, though, aren't you? Yep. Yep. All right. Well... Probably gonna end it here very quick. So we got like eighteen thousand dollars worth of carp and sturgeon in and how many minutes? In 13 minutes. Nuts. Alright. Well, if you guys want to see more fishing planet content, let me know down below. Um, if you guys like the video, please like and subscribe. And we're gonna get another one. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook this and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.